Pokemon Van Beastie. In Pokemon Go, the chance to encounter a shiny from a legendary raid is 1 in 20. The 1 in 20 odds comes from the Self Road website, where the average reported shiny legendary rate is 1 in 19.4, with a 95% confidence interval of 1 in 18.6 and 1 in 20.2. I'm assuming Niantic is using round numbers, so a 1 in 20 makes the most sense. To get straight to the point, with the odds of 1 in 20, completing 90 legendary raids will give you a 99% chance of encountering at least one shiny legendary. To get these results, instead of using the probability equations like binomial or geometric distributions, I use the more reliable method of simulating this in MATLAB with a sufficient number of players. The only caveat is the simulation has to be correct. The simulation is pretty straightforward. We take a player and have a random number generated between 1 and 20, with a nat 20 being the flag to say that a shiny was encountered. The random number generator is in a loop, where the loop is the player rating until they get a shiny. When a 20 is finally randomly generated, the player exits the loop and records how many raids they did until they encountered the shiny. And with this simulation, I ran it for 1 million players. That should be enough. And here is the probability density function, the simulated PDF result of the 1 million player simulation. As intuitively expected, about 5% of the players encountered a shiny on their first raid. 120 odds, that makes sense. As we continue along the PDF, about 4.74% of players encounter a shiny on their second raid, and 4.5% of the players encounter a shiny on their third so on and so forth. But the PDF does not properly convey the full story. A better way to view the result is through the simulated cumulative density function, or I'll call it SimCDF for short. The SimCDF is the probability that our event, in our case, a shiny legendary from a raid, will occur less than or equal to the number of raids shown below on a horizontal axis. So following the SimCDF graph after 90 raids, we expect a 99% chance of encountering a shiny. But since most of us can't do 90 raids in a week, let's take a look at our odds if we only use our free daily raid pass. The home event goes from January 19th to the 24th. So that gives us 6 days, so 7 passes total if you bank a pass from the day before. The sim CDF shows that completing 7 raids will give you about a 30% chance of encountering a shiny legendary raid. Okay. So 30% may be a bit too low to just rely on the free passes. So let's do some premium passes and some remote raid passes to increase our chance of encountering a shiny Kyogre or Groudon. Let's say that we double the amount of raids that we do, so 14 raids. The Sim CDF shows that we would have about a 51.2% chance of encountering a shiny legendary. Sweet. So 14 raids gets us down to essentially a coin flip of whether or not we will encounter a shiny legendary but leaving it up to a coin flip chance to get a shiny Kyogre or Groudon may not be good enough. So let's go hard and say that we'll do 5 raids a day for the duration of the event. So 30 raids total, and after 30 raids the odds of encountering at least one shiny raid goes up to 78.5%. So if you raid with 4 other friends doing 30 raids during the event, on average one of you will not get a shiny. Let's look at the CDF chart in a different way. A full raid lobby is 20 players. What are the odds that no one will encounter a shiny legendary? Take a look at the sim CDF chart, but instead of one player raiding 20 times, we're going to take 20 players raiding one time. We can still examine the same point on the chart because the odds don't change from player to player. So the chance of at least one shiny legendary encounter from a full lobby of 20 players is about 64.1%. So the converse, the odds of zero shiny legendaries from a full lobby is 35.9%. So more often than not, there will be at least one shiny legendary from a full raid lobby, but you shouldn't be surprised if no one gets a shiny. And finally, what about the most unlucky players? We've all heard the RNG horror stories where people will go well over 100 raids without encountering a shiny legendary. In my simulation of 1 million players, the 100 most unlucky players took 181 raids or more to encounter their shiny legendary. 
Therefore, you can say it is a reasonable estimate that you can expect a 0.01% chance, a 1 in 10,000 chance that it will take more than 180 raids to encounter a shiny legendary. Because of pure RNG and a large player base, even if it's very unlikely, I am sure this has happened in Pokemon Go. Thanks for watching, and I hope you learned something today. I'm Van Beastie, and I'll see you around.